this is the Doji S35, a new rugged phone from Doji, which is an ultra budget device. We have two gigs of RAM, 16 gigs of storage, a 4,350 milliamp hour battery, the MediaTek 6737V, a five inch HD display, Android 10, and yeah, those are our main specs. Let's open this thing up. So this whole phone costs $80. So let's see if it's good for that price. Okay. So the phone itself. Sad of the material is so far very good. So the phone is very thick. Um, so far looks good. Feels kind of light. In the box are USB C cable, a wristband, which you don't, which we never really see. Our 10 watt charging brick. We also get a plastic screen protector, semi injector tool, manual, and a few wipes to install the screen protector. But it already comes with one installed regardless. So yeah, this is Android 10 Go edition, by the way. So far, the display looks pretty nice, actually. Uh, I'm gonna set it, so I'm gonna set this up and get back to you. All right, the phone is all set up. The display looks pretty decent, not gonna lie. And the phone is pretty quick for the specs we have in the price. So you, as you can see, Play Store. I mean, yeah, it's low, but for the specs, it's all right. Okay, that was a bit too slow, gotta admit. And yeah, <laughs> as, I, as you can see, I already installed two apps. So first off, we're gonna test the face unlock because we don't have a fingerprint unlock. All right, the, the face recognition didn't work. I'm gonna try close up. All right, so the face unlock, it's pretty bad. It barely works. Uh, moving on. Tool bag. Uh, so here we have the plump bob warning port. So basically all the things we have with our other durable phones, except for like a few other things that are missing that I can't quite put my eye on, but. Oh. That is the weakest flash that I've ever seen. Let's see how knife it plays. Oh, God. Let's see how it is without ads. What? No, 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 it should... Oh, okay, there you go. So disabling ads didn't do much. And as expected, Wind Rider does not perform I mean does it perform better than I expected that's for sure all right so I think it's safe to say this phone is not meant for gaming oh thank you Okay, so I really like the speaker on this phone. So the, so the volume is decent, the quality is all right. Yeah, and not much else to say. The speaker is pretty average. I mean, so the speaker is pretty good, especially for $80. Rear camera is 13 megapixels. Front camera is five megapixels. Rear video is 720p. Front video is 480p. All right, first selfie. Let's go outside.
we're facing video on the Doji S35. Hmm, cool. Front facing video on the Doji S35. Let me know what you think. So yeah, that is pretty much it. So should you buy this phone? Well, it's durable. It's very, very durable. Um, but for, for, but for daily use, if you're used to something faster, it might be a bit of a pain uh, to use. But for the price, I think this phone is pretty good actually. Uh, yeah, if you have any questions, leave them in the comments and I will see you in the next video. Peace.